hello sir and hello guys it is actually the next day now my camera ended up dying last night when megan and i were together but that was the last thing that i did yesterday and we just watched tv and hung out i just wanted to come on and say hello and um i forgot to let you guys know that i now am proud owner of my own and my first record player like didn't think I was cool enough to get a record player. Like, it sounds so dumb thinking about it, but like, I genuinely just was kind of like, I'm not like a cool enough like person to own a record player. And then Megan was like, just get a record player. Like, what are you talking about? So, um, I thought it would also be like a really cool way to actually like, cause I get all of my music pretty much on Spotify. So I am one of those people that doesn't really buy an album unless I'm in love with the artist. He's looking for food, but he already ate his food a few hours ago, so I'm sorry, man. I rarely buy actual albums, so it's nice because with vinyls, like, I can actually support the artist and have something physical, and I didn't realize how cool vinyls were. They're very, very, like, cool looking. So I'm gonna show you guys the vinyls that I got, because I got them all off of Amazon, which is also where I got my record player. Let me show you my little setup really quick. So this is my record player. The brand is Audio Technica. This is a pretty affordable record player. It was about $90, I think, on Amazon. I get everything on Amazon. And the only thing I will say about this record player, which I don't know if this is true for all record players, I, I really don't know much about them, guys, so don't think I'm like, I know what I'm really talking about. But for this one, I had to buy speakers for it um, because that's the reason I got it. And for some reason, I like didn't think I needed speakers for it. I just didn't really know that you needed speakers for a record player, which that might sound stupid, but I, I didn't know. I'm a newbie. And so I didn't get them. And I've had the record player for like two weeks, but I haven't been able to get anything to play. And I was so confused why. And then Megan was like, dude, you just need to get some speakers. So. I got some speakers off Amazon. They are Bose and it's two speakers. I don't remember exactly what they're called, but I think they were $99. They don't go insanely loud, but they definitely go loud enough for me to be like, these are good speakers for my apartment. The vinyl I have on right now is Bryson Tiller Trap Soul. And I'll show you guys my records, um, which I need to get something to hold them up because they, I have been storing them vertical just for the sake of this vlog clip. I laid them out, but I don't have anything to actually store them vertically in. Um, but I'll give you guys a quick little overview of the ones I got. Again, I got them all at Amazon because I think that's like the, one of the cheapest places to get records. So we have Trap Soul by Bryson Tiller. Been loving that one. Amy Winehouse, Back to Black. She looks so gorgeous there. That was the first one that I played when I got it set up and it was very, very nice. <laughs> this is Foster the People Torches, which is their first album. In my opinion, this is such an underrated album. It's absolutely awesome. This album just is my type of like band music, like what I love bands to sound like. I don't know if that makes any sense, but I really love it. This is Awake by Tycho. It doesn't even say anywhere on it. Awake or Tycho, which I think is pretty cool. I didn't know how cool vinyls are. This is probably my fave one, which I haven't even played it yet, which is pretty lame. So I'll have to play it tonight. I have to Swiffer my floors. My Swiffer wet jet that I just got is over there. And I'm just like putting off Swiffering my floors because they're so dirty. And look how cool this one is though. This is Bass Nectar's uh, second to last like most recent album. The name of the album is Noise vs. Beauty or Noise vs. Beauty. I say versus, I don't know. So there's a beauty side, a noise side, a bass side, and a nectar side. This is what I'm saying when I'm like, I didn't know how cool vinyls actually were. Like, look how sick this looks. Then there's this whole thing that's like, talks about like every song on the album, which is just so freaking cool. So that's really, really cool. Shout out to you, Lauren. Fucking love you. I have a 21 Pilots Vessel. The back of that one is pretty cool too, actually. And then I have 21 Pilots Blurry Face because I fucking love 21 Pilots. Pretty freaking sweet. So yeah, hope you enjoyed that. I wanted to show you guys my pics and everything. I was eating barbecue chips, a lot of barbecue chips. I have been 
so oh my god the reason i don't post on my fitness instagram anymore the reason i don't talk about working out anymore and any of that stuff is because i completely fell off of it pretty much the time that i started up school again is just when i completely fell off stopped working out a, a part of it was i don't live as close to my trainer as i used to since i moved downtown i just don't go to the gym anymore and i don't make time for working out and i hate that i do it because I was so much more productive with everything in my life when I was like working out regularly and like not eating terribly. At the same time, it's like, it's not that I don't wanna be doing it. It's like, I do wanna be doing it. I am like annoyed at myself for letting that kind of like go and letting my progress go and things like that. Around this time last year is actually like a month from right now, last year is when I like started up. So I'm hoping, I'm actually meeting with my trainer tomorrow because we are working on something exciting for the future i just would like to know how do you guys get back on track what like what motivates you to get back on track when you've been off track for a really long time because i've been not working out regularly since like literally since like september or october it's true like that seems so long right now thinking about that like that's when i moved into this apartment and that's when i really started getting bad so i just don't feel good about it because i want to be like on track and I want to be healthy and not eating crap but I've been eating so much crap at least now that I live downtown I walk pretty much everywhere like I at least I can say that I walk a lot but other than that I really don't do anything so <laughs> I would love to know your tips and your advice in the comments below and we can have a convo but yeah thank you very much for watching this vlog I would love to hear you guys's feedback on everything i love you guys thank you for watching thank you for listening to my rants and everything that i talk about you guys are fucking awesome and i absolutely love you and i'll see you in the next vlog bye